Have you heard about the Blueberry Detox Firming Peel by Eminence Organics and wondered if it would be a good treatment for your skin? Today I'm talking about how we integrate this treatment, rich in polyphenols and Hungarian paprika, into your facial. First, we start your facial with a double cleanse. Typically, we use the lemon cleanser, followed by the stone crop gel wash with a sprinkle of strawberry rhubarb dermafoliant mixed in. Next, we apply one of the liquid exfoliating peels. Your esthetician might choose the Firm Skin Acai Exfoliating Peel for fine lines or the Bright Skin Licorice Root Exfoliating Peel to target hyperpigmentation. The next layer is the AHA Fruit Pulp. This professional treatment contains whole fruit pulp from apples and grapes, lactic acid, and naysberry sugars to remove dead skin and refine the skin's appearance. And finally, the star of this facial, the Blueberry Detox Firming Peel. Ready? <laughs> the polyphenols in this product help the skin fight inflammation from environmental stressors. The berries have an astringent and toning effect, but it's the Hungarian paprika that really shines. The heat generated is not the kind that causes the skin stress. The opposite, in fact, the increased blood flow helps push toxins out of the skin via the lymphatic system. The increased oxygen is especially beneficial for acne-prone skin or skin that is just looking a little dull. No need to be alarmed when you see how flushed the skin gets. It's just your capillaries doing a great job of bringing oxygen and nutrients to the skin. We call this microcirculation. The massage we offer circulates most of the redness out of the skin leaving a healthy glow at the end of your facial. The facial massage releases tension held in the facial muscles, activates pressure points, softens fine lines, and calms the central nervous system by stimulating the vagus nerve. It relieves stress held in the neck and shoulders. And in the end, your skin and body are made a little happier and healthier. Thanks for watching.